Hey guys, welcome back to Ultra Unknowns. Today I'm going to be showing you how to start up a 737. I'm in the default default uh, Zebo 737 in X Plane 11, so let's get right into the video. Okay. So now we're in our cockpit. There we go. Now the best thing about this aircraft is whether you've got a GPU or anything whatsoever you can automatically use ground power when you're on the ground and it'll power up your aircraft for you now once you've done that you can f switch on the fasten seatbelt sign or you're gonna have some pat passengers are injured and your insurance will not cover you for having the fasten seatbelt sign switched off okay so next if you're preparing to taxi you're gonna have your taxi light on and you're going to want to turn on your fuel pumps next you go to your battery make sure that your battery is on auto here for your standby power to run off now power on your battery because I'm going to be departing straight away then you can now switch on your hydraulic pumps and I like to keep on my anti-ice as it is cold out here now generally you would be turning up your panel brightness or whatever junk you want to put on however I could not give anything about brightness at the moment uh, because I do not need that. Now I'm going to start my APU. You'll see that climbing. Now it's on. Yep. Okay. Then what you want to do is head over to this panel over here above the autopilot's chair and you want to make sure you won't be able to start your engines without your APU bleed on. Okay, once that is on, that should be all good for you. Now I'm just going to put on all my lights down here. The lights don't play any effect for your flight whatsoever in getting your engines up and running. But I'm going to use them. In fact, I'm just going to turn on all the lights. I don't care about any rules whatsoever here. I'm just going to turn on all the lights because I want to take off right away. So I'm going to put on my landing lights and everything. Okay, once you have that done, you are basically ready to start your engines. So, as you can see, now you've got the battery powered up. You can switch off your ground power and you'll have it on. So, to start your engines, on the ground, you're going to want to go to ground for your engine starters. Then come down to the panel down here and switch on the cutoff. and you should see the numbers starting to boom up there okay so I'm just gonna log in my FMC route here I'm gonna be flying from in fact uh, I won't do the FMC now I'll do that in a separate tutorial And as you can see, there are my engines starting up. You can see the waves going off now. My engines are started there. And off we go. So Now you can just use your throttle and continue with your flight as normal. You are set for takeoff. You can control your flaps and everything now. And you're set for takeoff, so it's as quick as that. Such an easy setup there. Just to set up, you would generally be setting up your autopilot and everything, which I am about to do a tutorial for. So that's basically all, guys, on just setting up the 737 ready for a departure, just at its basics there. So thanks so much, guys, for watching and. Please do recommend any tutorials you would like to see down in the comments below. If you thought this was helpful, please do leave a thumbs up.
Look forward to catching you in the next tutorial. Thanks guys.